My name is Nora Helmi. I go to John D. O'Brien of Math and Science. My name is Eddie Louie, and I just graduated Boston Latin School. My name is An Nguyen, and I just graduated from Boston Latin Academy. My name is Abu Bakar Kanate. I went to the English High School. So I got the job through PIC. Uh, PIC is the Private Industry Council. We had like different career specialists at my school. So I just went up to him and was like, hey, I'm looking for a job. He told me about this opportunity. My PIC counselor um, helped me through the process of creating my resume. I went through applications and I went to, through interviews. Just waited for that call and I got it. <laughs> I work um, uh, with the Wally program at uh, Red Sox. So on an average day of work, I would come in um, at 3 if necessary to clean up uh, the wallet room to um, lo reload the fridge. Then um, I would go out um, onto the infield with Wally for pre-game ceremonies. For pre-game, I escort Wally around. I carry a flag that he waves um, during pre-game ceremonies. I talk for him if um, it's necessary because he can't talk. And I also take pictures of him, uh, which is used for Twitter and Facebook. I work in the surgical department, and I work 8.30 to 5. And what I basically do is when I come in, I either I have different tasks to do every day. So sometimes my job, my boss will make me like, um, scan papers, like billing charts for patients. I'll prep patients' charts. I'll do like the doctor visits and uh, mail them out. The biggest benefit that we get from this is seen in um, the other staff and their ability to get caught up in work, um, their ability to just um, use Nora to help them spend more time on more complicated patient-related issues. So those 15 to 20 minutes that they're saving us can be used to book a surgery or something of the like that directly affects patient care. So I think the, the benefit, the cost-benefit analysis will show that it is a wonderful, wonderful program. I work for Boston Properties in the Prudential Tower. I learned a lot of new skills and I really like that. And I also learned how to be, you know, independent since my my bosses and managers, they're not always telling me what to do and I have to be on my own and keeping at my own pace and knowing what to do. We uh, get a resource that we can augment our team to kind of deliver on projects this summer uh, and then separately we get a fresh perspective you know as head of an IT department um, it's really important to kind of bring in young talent, a fresh perspective, people who have grown up with the internet. My favorite part of the workday is seeing the children smile because um, if Wally can make a child smile, then it kind of makes my day, it makes the day worth it. One day we actually had shorter staff and they had to help, they had to have me like actually get like, not in contact with the patient, but I like, I actually had to help out with things that I don't usually do every day. So it's like to step up the scale a little, it's just like, oh, I'm getting the spotlight now, you know? It was my time to shine. I kind of like now talk more professionally, I act more professionally, and I'm I'm kind of, I, I think I'm, I'm pretty different now. And John Hanko has made me become that person. Before, I didn't really know what I wanted to do. It's, it's what, it's like experimenting what could be for me and, you know, what I wanted to do in the future. It gives a teenager an opportunity to really feel out um, and have a better idea when going into college what they can potentially go into. Even though I work in the surgical department right now, um, I recently got an invitation from another gentleman that works here. He, he was like, oh, come help out in the trauma department. So it's like I'm being exposed to like different other things that I like absolutely love and it helps me now narrow down what I actually want to do in the future. This internship could actually land me a potential job here. I've gotten a lot of opportunities here at John Hancock. John Hancock is amazing. Like once you come here and you open yourself to everybody, everybody is there to help you. Like I wanted to do like work in a business area like this before, but then I never thought I would have the chance to do it. But having the chance to do it as a high school student that means a lot to me. I mean, I tell my friends all the time, like I have, I got this job and I'm really lucky. I think I'm getting the full experience. So. I found this opportunity was like it's just calling my name. I have to go for it. So it's absolutely a wonderful experience, and I would everyone should at least have an experience like this. Summer jobs really give young people an opportunity to open up the world to them. It builds their confidence, they learn how to network, they get economic independence, 
they find new friends. The young people are the future workers of our city. If you have an educated workforce, we'll have a good business community in the future. As I know we have some of the best kids in the world here. They have new ideas, they're a little more creative than most, but they have this energy, they don't get tired. Those different types of opportunities really help students blossom literally over the summer um, and you're able to see that in the fall and they come back very aggressive thinking I'm going to take over the world and that's the type of attitude that we want from all our students so um, definitely the students make it make this whole entire job worth it.